Hey guys, what's going on? It's Eli, back with another review video, and that's right, I'm reviewing this, and actually, fun fact, uh, because, uh, because <laughs> after, uh, like, cause as I record this, and I had finished recording, like, say, my review of Kung Fu Panda, and I checked, well, as you guys know, um, I hadn't filmed this yet, but it's already out. I had already reviewed uh, my review of The Secret of Nim had, was, is out, and, uh, as I record this, I hadn't, rec I haven't recorded it yet, but I'm sure you get what I'm saying, okay? So, uh, but yeah, but The Secret of, my review of The Secret of Nim is out, uh, but as I record this, well, you know, I haven't reviewed it yet, I haven't recorded it yet, but you get the idea. Uh, so I was wrong what I said, uh, in my review of Kung Fu Panda 2 at the end, that, you know, finally reviewing something of Don Bluth. Well, I already did, but you get the idea. Anyways, so, now, of course, we're reviewing, after reviewing The Secret of Nim, the first Don Bluth I had filmed, there we go, now I'm reviewing the second Don Bluth film that, for this month, Anastasia. Yes, Anastasia. It's great, and this was definitely the comeback for for only for that, you know, for Don Bluth, you know, making a ma an animation masterpiece. Because, like, from the early 80s, you know, uh, he made some great films, and when it came up to the early 90s, things kind of went downhill for Bluth, sadly, you know? Um, uh, but uh, when it came, like, to the mid-90s, things got a little bit better for Bluth when he moved to Fox Animation Studios... And, and him and Gary Goldman, they made Anastasia, based on, like, this, uh, like, on the events of, like, the Romanoff family and just so on, you know? Well, uh, yeah, Anastasia is such a good film, and, um, it's got a great cast, you know? Meg Ryan as Anastasia, John Cusack as, uh, Dementri, and, uh, Angela, Dame Angela, Dame Angela Lansbury as, uh, well, as Anastasia's mother, um, uh, then there's also, uh, Vla Vladimir, voiced by Kelsey Grammer, who's alongside with Dimit Dimitri, and then, like, uh, there's also Bartok, uh, like, the little, like, white bat-like creature, voiced by Hank Azaria. Yeah, I love Hank Azaria, he's such a good actor and such a great guy. And then the main villain of the film, Ras. Putin, voiced by none other than Christopher Lloyd, Doc Brown himself, Judge Doom, I could go on, <laughs> Uncle Fester, but okay. Um, and even Jim Cummings, he did the singing voice of Rasputin. And you know what? This film has some great songs to it, especially Rasputin's song, you know, In the Dark of the Night, blah, 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 She'll Be Mine! And, you know, Jim Cummings, he is the singing voice of Rasputin. He does well. Um, well, it's Jim Cummings, you know, he's a good singer, you know, because he's a legendary voice actor. But this film was really good, um, with the cast of characters, and I'm not really sure, I'm looking at, uh, the, the, the cast, like, like, apparently, like, Arthur May, Ma Mallet was, did a voice, and so did J.K. Simmons. I, I really don't know, but, uh, yeah, but still, and, and, uh, other characters, like Sophie, voiced by Bern Bernadette Peters, and there was also... Kristen Dunst, who voiced a young Anastasia, of course. Um, oh, who else? Well, you know, this film I thought was really good, and it's got great animation to it. And, of course, in the hands of Don Bluth and Gary Goldman, um, you know, and because uh, everything about this is great. Like, it, mostly, of course, it centers on, of course, the main characters, like the three characters, Anastasia, Dimitri, and uh, Vladimir, and some sad moments here and there, and even, like, you know, uh, they're basically, like, Dimitri and Vladimir at the beginning, like, they're, like, con artists, you know, and, like, you know, they realize that Anastasia is THE Anastasia. And even Dimitri was there when the Rasputin family was under attack, when, you know, um, Rasputin put a curse on them, and Dimitri was a little boy and such, and so, you know, he was there, and, like, you know, I think he starts remembering, too, and, uh, even, like, the, the queen, or, you know, voiced by Angela Lansbury, remembers Dimitri. Yeah, just, you know, all I gotta say is, you know, Anastasia, it's such a good animated film, and the first time I watched it was, well, when it was on, of course, when it's, when, you know, with it being on Disney+. Plus. So, there you go. 
Um, but, uh, yeah, Anastasia, all I gotta say is, it's great, I love it, and I give this, um, uh, I give the, oh, how do I rate this? I hope this is, you know, I hope, it, it's still good, I guess, when I, we, you know, when I give it, uh, 8 out of 10. Just 8 out of 10 stars for Anastasia, it's still good, so, you know. And you guys let me know what you think of Anastasia, you know, what you thought of my review. Leave comments as always, give it a like, and yeah. So again, 8 out of 10 for Anastasia. I hope you guys enjoyed my review of Anastasia. More reviews coming your way, they're gonna be awesome. Keep looking forward, and I'll see you guys in the next video slash review video. Take care, and peace out.